Pronunciation in English is an online, interactive program. Pronunciation in English helps you use the important elements of stress, intonation, and rhythm, like a native speaker. Pronunciation in English is now divided into two levels, High Beginning Plus and Intermediate Plus. It features American, British, and Australian speakers of English. The program offers both video and audio lessons, record and playback, and text is available in 10 languages. This is the table of contents for Intermediate Plus. By selecting one of the 10 language options, you can view the lecture notes and instructions in that language. If you don't select a language option, it defaults to English. The new Enhanced Navigation allows you to see the program index from the table of contents by rolling over the symbol of the magnifying glass in the lower left. Rolling over each chapter on the table of contents screen will show you a chapter level index. To see an even more detailed index, click on the Index button on the table of contents. At the word level, there are syllables that are stressed and unstressed. At the sentence level, there are stressed words and unstressed words. In sentences, the basic stress pattern is usually created by stressing content words, like nouns, main verbs, adverbs, and adjectives. Click on the number to hear the sentence. Click on the stressed words in each phrase. Their team worked on a roadmap for their new product releases. Here's how it looks after the words are clicked. They turn red and provide a visual model for the recording and playback exercises. Mouse over the TOEFL Skill Builder button to get more information. Then we'll look at one of the many practices that follow. This is a dictation practice. Notice that the focus word in the phrase should be in parentheses. Cycling and yoga are both popular classes. Now we'll look at one of the paragraph level practices. Notice that the content words turn red and the focus words turn red and get underlined. Again, this gives students a guide for listening to this passage and recording it. The Lion and the Mouse once, when a lion was asleep, a little mouse began running up and down his back. Next, we'll go to the intonation chapter. Here's a practice page. The cowboys saddled the horses early so they could ride out before dawn. We'll skip past the video for intonation in yes-no questions. To look at a practice, note that the intonation goes up at the end of these questions. Do you think this stock will go up again? This chapter explores the rhythm that native speakers often use. Matching these rhythms will help your spoken English be understood more easily. Here are a couple of practices for reduction. We have to complete the building within 30 days. The concert featured a lot of different musicians. Then there's a final review. There are four rotating versions of this final review. They all provide scoring. Pronunciation in English is used in the language labs at hundreds of schools and universities and by thousands of individuals worldwide. Here's some user feedback. The English Skills Series.